Monday, um, Monday dance. We are at the gym, obviously, um, in our PE Nation gym gear, not by um, choice, it's coincidence. Hashtag not sponsored. Not sponsored. <laughs> um, I'm wearing mine. We both got asked from Shopper, I think. Not from My Theresa. Not this jumper. I got... You got the jumper from My Theresa. Oh, okay. Shopper, My Theresa. Yeah, um, and we're both wearing Adidas tights um, and our Nikes. It's dress fashionable for the gym, you know. I know, we're just going to go work out and then we're going to go to Cam World, get some stuff. Hope we're going to Target, try and find more of those jeans that we like Marissa has and I try and wear all the time. Oh yeah. So, also, we'll take you shopping. Also, YouTubers, um, we're thinking of doing, if you live in Melbourne, we're thinking of doing Campbell Market Store. Um, what do you guys think? If you guys live in Melbourne, would you want us to do one? Is it the 30th of August or? I, they, I haven't booked it yet, but there's some in July. Okay. Um, but we have some more stuff with Gova from our, from our blogger sale, so if you're from Melbourne, let us know. Bye. Good morning, guys. It's Tuesday morning. We are, is it Tuesday morning? Yeah, it is. For, I knew it was Tuesday, but I just was questioned for a second. Anyway, we are going off now to Chatston. Um, <clears throat> we are doing a really exciting shoot this week with Burberry. Um, so we're going to pick up our pieces that we're loaning for to wear. And I also want to go to a unique look. So I'm going to get a puffer jacket because it's cold AF outside. And when I go to the gym, I'm freezing um, because I have a puffer vest. So I'm going to buy a jacket and I might buy some thermals as well. Um, and I think. Beck wants to go to Zara Man for Ari to get some stuff, or to look at some stuff for him. Um, so I'll show you what I'm wearing quickly and what Beck's wearing, she'll come in soon. Um, but yesterday, you know how we've been banging on about these Target jeans um, that I have, and Beck's like, oh, I need to go to Target some jeans. Anyway, yesterday we went to Target. So I'm kind of focused. Um, yesterday we went to Target and got ourselves new pair, new black jeans. Um, so I'll show you what I'm wearing and I was waffling until Beck got here and she's just arrived. Oh, it's quite bright now. Thank you, Beck. So, this is what we are wearing today. Let's step back a bit so you can see. Why is the exercise ball in our room? Oh, because my back was really sore the other day. I was stretching. Uh, my I was room. so confused. Just like, back out. Why is blue exercise ball just like hanging out in the background? <coughs> Stretch my hey, back out. That makes sense. Um, so, I am wearing my J.W. Anderson jumper that I got from the outnet that I've only worn once. So I'm glad Shame I'm wearing it. on you for a photo shoot as well. <laughs> no, for the for technique the of it. Yeah. So I'm glad I'm wearing it again. Um, I'm wearing it with my sports girl bl blue jeans, which are like freshly becoming my favorite jeans. Mm. Um, my Oscar de la Renta shoes that I wore last week and a furler bag. Yes. And Beck oh. is wearing I'm wearing my Not Today Satan top. <laughs> People last one commented in the last week's vlog. No, like, not today, Satan. Anyway, best comment. Uh, I'm wearing that. My Camaro Mark double breasted, um, like, tweed blazer. Mini Target jeans. Yep. Yes. 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 So the key is these. I've already ripped them. The key is these jeans, with these jeans, to. Because. Sorry. Fray the edges. Fray the edges. I'm trying to focus. Stop moving. There we go. Um, and what shoes are you wearing? Um, they're, um, Envy the label. So, it's a spread here. Cool. They're um, a new brand. They just launched, or they're launching soon. Um, they're really great. So the Instagram is MV the label. They're so cool. Actually. Anyway, so the the key is of the Target jeans that we bought them because we're about 170 centimeters. So we're like kind of all right height, average height. Um, the key is to buy the regular length, not the ankle length, because then they're kind of baggy at the ankle, and then you cut them just above the ankle, because then the bagginess is not super tight at the ankle. These so. are the other shoes that off. I'm sorry, for MV the label. And there's the oh, other cool, shoes. Cool, hey. They're very um, pointy. They're very Oracle Fox esque. They're, they're cool, cool though. I think they look great if you had a really small foot. Like we yeah. don't have small feet. Actually, can I try them on with the blue jeans? They look bad. No, I'm not angry at it. Neither am I. But like, I think this look really cool, like a flare pant or like a palazzo. I, I mean, um, a collot. Yeah, they're kind of cool. Or a mini skirt. Or a mini skirt. Do they look bad with these jeans? No. Like maybe I wore like a really nice long top, like more like evening wear. They're kind of yeah. like ma the the Manolo Manolo Blonic like shape, but yeah. just um. They're really cool. So they're the other pair of Envy the label they're shoes. Cool. And then this is the third pair we got. 
They're kind of Aquazora-esque. They're really cute though, the pom-poms. Oh, they're so cool. I'm excited to wear them. Yeah, so anyway, let us go. <laughs> Wednesday. Um, not so much a happy Wednesday for us because I don't know if it's too empty or I, but we both have our periods. So we're in a significant amount of pain. Um, but nevertheless, we have done our workout at the gym. Usually we'd be like, mm, not going. But we went anyway and did a really good like ab core workout to help distract from the lower region of pain. Um, now we're about to go to um, a consignment shop called Eurotrash to try and list some of our designer pieces. Um, I'll show you what I'm wearing. I look kind of boggy, but I'm like, whatever, it's fine. This is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my Uniqlo puffer. I've just buttoned up the top because I feel like a bit extra today. With a jumper I got from Zara ages ago. It says, um, what does it say? Claudia Schiffer. Um, I've got my Stronger the Label leggings, um, Adidas Gazelles, um, and my belly nails sunglasses, which are finally fixed because they broke in the case the other day, which is really upsetting. Um, and Marissa looks a little bit less extra, but still in black. She's wearing a steel um, jumper mm -hmm. with my Zalia, other jacket, Adidas leggings, and Nikes. So I'm a bit extra with my like collar popped, so I'm feeling like just stay away from me today. Squish, squish, fish. Yep. I know, I really don't like that song. I've heard it once from Katy Perry. It's really catchy. But then the beat's really catchy. The lyrics and the song is rubbish, but the swish, swish, bish, but that beat's the best part. Squish, squish. Now I'm just really squishes. Comfy. It says squish, squish. Squish, squish, bish. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> Um, today, oh, it's so sunny. Today, we are filming a video Woo! on like our um, top jackets for winter. Yeah, <coughs> we're gonna call it jacket essentials. Yeah, jacket essentials basically. Um, so, just setting up our little tripod here. Um, I'm gonna start filming. I'm not in the video as if I'm just wearing. me. I'm wearing other boots currently. I'm done filming. Yes, so I'm and producing. We'll insert, a, we'll, insert, we'll insert a clip here. Yeah. Our list, which is probably my favorite because it's my purchase, um, is my, I guess, tomato orange um, J. Crew jacket. Um, I got it from the Netaporter sale um, a few weeks ago. Maybe it was like literally three weeks ago. Um, and it's so amazing. The first one, obviously, is Zara. Zara did the best blazers ever for a high street entry price point. Um, got this one, which you would have said on our Instagram again. Um, it's it was roughly $120, I think. Um, but I love it. Oh, it fits so nicely. And again, like I said. So we just finished filming Marissa's outfit for Burberry at the beautiful Parliament House in Melbourne. Um, many a backdrop to many a bloggers in Melbourne. Yes. Um, this is Marissa's outfit, so I'm gonna get on a step. So she's wearing the Burberry trench coat in the colour honey. I think it's the honey. It's like one of their traditional, their, their basic traditional trench coats with this amazing lace applique dress um, underneath. It's one of our dresses underneath for a, a slip. I don't know if you can hear me, <laughs> but then um, she's wearing the most amazing, amazing Burberry boots. It's like a sock boot with this gorgeous like 
round detail for the heel, which is so stunning. So this is her full look. Yeah, that's it. On to my outfit. So we just finished shooting Beck's look. I don't think you can hear me, hopefully you can. We just finished shooting Beck's look. This is what she's wearing, bar the shoes. She's changed her shoes because she's given up. She's wearing a white shirt dress from Burberry, the other trench coat, I think it's the same colour actually to be honest. It's a honey colour. Yeah, and um, shoes from Envy the label. And also her earrings are from Air, um, from... Dun 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 Elix, Elix earring label. Elix, there we go. They're really pretty. Love them. So we done. We done, we out. We out. See you Melbourne. That Burberry bag. and tomorrow this is my second juice of the day so um, we're doing the green street juice cleanse just because as you guys know we have a lot of allergies and stuff and we just want to kind of clear our digestion out and kind of start from fresh again because we tend to not eat to our allergy <coughs> requirements not often but um it's sometimes, hard. sometimes Marissa will order a non-gluten-free Nutella pizza and it's worth it and yeah you know, you're sometimes when you're hormonal and you want to eat whatever um yep. you want to eat carbs and carbs aren't necessarily all gluten friendly no so anyway so we are on um the green street juice um clans will li label this where you can buy them online We're from australia i don't ask me i have an idea i think it's australia wide um but i'm on to my second juice it's the central park one so it promotes out al it alkalize it says alkalize and glow smoothie so that's that one so it's got, and actually, like, it's good, you gotta do it here. Really? Yeah, because before you're doing it up here, and I'm like, okay, they can't see any of it. <laughs> it's got celery, cucumber, spinach, lemon, parsley, banana, avocado, chia seeds, and superfood green boost. It's actually delicious, I already had mine. The superfood green boost has kale leaf powder, collard great greens powder, sprouted by fermented pea fiber, broccoli sprout powder, broccoli, natural sea mineral complex from wild harv harvested seaweed. So um, it's been really nice. It these tastes are, like banana because banana is a very overpowering flavor. These are um really really low in fructose. If not have no fructose in them at all, or use products that have don't have enough fructose to I guess affect. Yeah, and it's cool. People ask us like, ask us on Instagram. They're like, how can you do a juice cleanse if you can't have fruit? Um, <laughs> but well, <laughs> well, it's a quite obvious question to ask. But if you have fructose malabsorption or you've heard of the FODMAP diet. You know that some fruits it's delicious. I know some fruits and vegetables affect um, some people more. So, for example, very high fruit and veggies in that are high in fructose would be onion and garlic, apples, um, pear, nectarines, asparagus, asparagus leeks. So, that if you have if you're aware of format diet, there's a list essentially like do not eat, and you can eat in moderation. So, um, and the, the veggies you can eat in moderation, like on this list here of what's ingredients. So. Um, the celery is eat in moderation. Yeah. So if you have a little bit of celery, imagine there's probably like one stick of celery in here. That's yeah. Um, it's actually trying to taste probably like half a stick yeah. of celery. So for example, um, obviously if we have tons um, and tons of celery, yeah, like we can't have 19 bananas in a week, but we no. can have one or two and it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. So um, obviously it's all in moderation. Every single person is different as well. I know some girls that absolutely can not, I can feel like we can absolutely not have apple at all in, under any circumstances. Or pear. Or pear. And even though we, like, I remember a few weeks ago we had some apple, we had an apple tart at an event. And one of the girls is like, aren't you going to get really sick from that? She goes, that will affect me in five seconds. And I'm like, yeah, you know what? But it's kind of, it, I want it. 
and then we had two bites. I had the whole thing. Oh, I had two bites. <laughs> In the car, five minutes later, I was like, wow, this is, I don't have apple. I was like, head was throbbing. We had all day headache. Yeah. Really sick in the stomach. I take a nap. Anyway, <clears throat> but, yeah. so some, but some girls who, or guys who have fructose and absorption can have apple. It just really depends on the strain or how it affects you. Um, I know for us, for me, for example, I can, I know that for example, red onion, like Spanish onion, raw onion in any circumstance Worse. is a no no. It's like the devil, it's the worst thing ever, but cooked onion in like a sauce is okay. Uh, see, I don't, I won't feel like the cramps of it. I'll feel, I don't know, it's garlic is bad. Is but my frame bowing? I'm not sure. Sorry, that's really random. Um, but like, whereas garlic for me is like a big no worst. no. I'll get dry mouth, I'll get dehydrated, I'll get crampy. Lactose for me, like some some lactose I can't have. Like in, like I can have cheeses and they're okay. I'll get a little bit yucky, but cheese or okay, yogurt's fine. But if I have ice cream, see yeah, you later, pal. So true. See you later. Anyway, I am sick. so the point of this is we don't know how it really affects us because it's kind of just like a stab in the dark. You're just mm. like I might be fine, but I might not. Um, so these gut health like cleanses are really good just to reboot our system as we like to do. I'm feeling pretty good at the moment anyway. I haven't really felt like my gut's been really playing up at all yeah, recently. But it's good just to do just to cleanse your system. And not as a, and this is a disclaimer, when we say cleanse your system, it's not a diuretic no. juice cleanse. It doesn't make you go to the toilet. I don't mean like to cleanse and like to crap everything out. I mean just in terms of like just getting the toxins out of your body, get your body functioning the way Crap with nice good probiotics in your stomach or repairing yeah. lining in your stomach, especially for us because the things we can eat, like the gluten or whatever, really erodes our stomach and really makes it really susceptible to having more allergies. Yeah. So um yeah, it just helps build the immunity back up, up in our tummy and we're taking Aussie with probiotics as we usually do anyway. So it's putting back the good, healthy germs in our tummy and in our gut so that we can function a bit better than usual. Yeah. So it's good so far. We'll let you know how it goes. But it's Yay. it's delicious. It's delicious. It's Crack really celery. It's really yummy. It's the banana really, and avocado really, are really thick it just, and And you can buy them as is from stores as well. So yeah. you probably have heard of green tea juices before anyway because you can buy them in store as single, singular juice. So it's like going to boost and getting a smoothie, but it's better for you. And it's for two full days. Mm. So... I'm really enjoying it so far. Happy Sunday. So um, we're just about ready to go to church. Marissa is just finishing brushing her teeth. My hair feels a bit like... I don't know if I'm loving my hair today. It's just kind of like a bit like messy. Anyway, nevertheless. Um, this is what I'm wearing today. I'm just wearing a white shirt from Grana um, with our Camilla and Mark sort of navy um, and black and gold blazer over the top of the gold details. Um, Marissa's Gucci belt, my Target jeans, Whitner boots, which is like a stock standard outfit, um, YSL bag, and then my new earrings from Elix. Not Elix label, but Elix label, I think it's called. Anyway. And Marissa, Hello. this is Marissa. Sunday. Sunday. What are you wearing, miss? Um, so I'm wearing a new jumper that I got on sale at COS. It was half price, it was a, and then it came to $50, so I was like, yes, new coat. I don't have any thin black jumpers. Uh, I've got this full trench coat that we got a couple weeks ago, tight jeans, Bex shop bot belt, yep. and my Ostella Renter flats. Awesome. Let us go. Let's go to church. Alright, so, juice cleanse update. Um, yesterday we did our juice cleanse, um, it was two days obviously. We felt kind of sick this morning, but it's because we did eat food yesterday as well, because we we're really hungry. Um, whoops. Whoops. Yeah, so um, I still really like it. This is actually, it tastes, all tastes really, really yummy. They're it's, delicious. So then I think I got a headache. I think because I've been, we've been both been having our period this week, so we're both like binging on food as you do when you're in your period. Um, I think also, and then going from that to just drinking liquids. Yeah, it was quite gut, challenging. My gut was kind of like, sorry if this is too, TMI, but my gut was kind of like, I can't cope and I'm not going to let you be able to go to the bathroom. 
yeah, it was just a bit, a bit, bit challenging. Um, but today we're on it again. On to the second juice of the my day. My favourite one, I think. Which is the Central Park, which has got celery, cucumber, spinach, lemon, parsley, banana, avocado, cheese seeds, and superfood I green fruit. I don't like that, but it's my favourite one. Yeah, it just tastes really banana -y, so it's quite nice. Um, so we're doing that. Yeah, yeah we're doing that now. Um, but we'll probably still have lunch at church, to be honest. But I might just... Um, I think the issue was yesterday that we ate dinner, but then still continue to drink, drink the juices. So it was yeah. like too much that we're consuming. Um, because also the point is that they replace food. Um, so I think I might just skip the next after uh, the next two, so I can eat lunch. I think my main issue actually was um, the, the second last juice before the bone broth. This is um, had dandelion in it, which for some reason, like, it's not, it hasn't got fructose in it, but for some reason it always affects me. I think the last time I had, like years ago, we had like the skinny me tea stuff. They I had, think it's it skinny me tea. Yes. No, it had dandelion in it, and I got really crampy from the dandelion. Well, I got really <laughs> crampy last night, and I didn't have it. I didn't have that juice. So I think maybe this, maybe the food we ate, just in, com in conjunction with the cleansing of our with the juice, it just wasn't a good combo, so no, it wasn't a good time. Oops a daisies. Um but we're just hungry and I can't I think it was the I whole actually, mental battle. I actually wasn't hungry. I wasn't I wasn't hungry like I'm so starved. I just I was love like food. Yeah I was kinda of like no but it's meant to be dinner time right now and, and I, I really haven't eaten all day I and think, that kind of oh confuses my God, that dog's me. so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh it's so little. Um, no but I think because it's people like watching the footy and you mm. kinda of like gather around the fire pit of food that's kind of like our vibe with like footy yeah and stuff. but anyway so um we'll let you know when we get home from church i guess how the rest of the day is going now we might might yeah we'll just fill you, on the, fill you in in the evening hey guys so just back from church you can see back in the mirror oh there go um just back from church update on the juice cleanse all is going I'm going to have another one now. All's going pretty well. Um, my tummy, I don't know. I do like this juice cleanse. I think I prefer the other one a little bit better. That sounds weird, but I'm getting all the headaches from this juice cleanse. I don't know if it's because um, it's like really detoxing, but I don't usually get headaches from them. So I'm not quite sure what's going on. But nonetheless, it's they're actually really delicious and they're really yummy. And you can buy them in single, just juices as well. So if you don't do the full shebang like juice cleanse, you can just do like... A couple of them a day, that kind of stuff as well. Cause they are quite yummy and quite filling. So yeah, that's it. I'm um, sorry, I'm just moving stuff. I am onto the celery cucumber spinach lemon pasta. I actually like that one. It's really easy. Yeah, to it's drink. nice. But we will sign off here. Um, yeah, we'll sign off here. We're just talking about next week at church. We're having a relation, our relationship series of signing sick at church. It's a three-week series about relationships. And we've been asked to be on the panel at church. Yeah. Um, and it's a bit scary, but it's fine. I know. We'll be good. We're asking a lot of questions, answering a lot of questions as well. So um, I might get one of our partners to film it on the vlog, potentially, if possible. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, we're just going to be today, rest of the day, starting some outfits. So tomorrow, shoot with Katie, and also maybe just going through some of our questions um, for the panel and answering the best we can. Yeah. So we'll sign off here. We'll see you next week. Cheers. Bye.